Hello, I am your teacher, Gary Vernier. Welcome to Activate Your Grammar. Today, you are going to learn how to use the present tense in negative sentences in English. Let's begin with what you already know, the present tense in negative sentences in Spanish. In Spanish, it is very easy. You simply add the word no before the verb. For example, hablo, no hablo, estudia, no estudia, jugamos, no jugamos. Unfortunately, it is not that easy in English. So how do we form a negative sentence in English? Well, in English, you always need to use two words to form a negative sentence. Do or does plus not. In other words, the word no in Spanish means do not or does not in English. Let's look at some examples. Spanish, yo no hablo inglés. English, I do not speak English. Did you see how no in Spanish becomes do not in English? Here's another example. Ella no habla inglés. She does not speak English. Once again, did you notice how no in Spanish becomes does not in English? Let me repeat the rule again. No in Spanish equals do not or does not in English. The video will now stop and you will have an activity to identify verbs in the present tense in negative sentences. Okay, so how do you know when to use do or does? The answer is pretty simple. If the subject is he, she, or it, you use the word does. If the subject is I, you, we, or they, you use the word do. Here are some examples. I do not speak, you do not speak, we do not speak, they do not speak. He does not speak, she does not speak, it does not speak. Did you notice how we do not add an S to the end of the verb in negative sentences like we do in affirmative sentences? The verb is always the same. It never changes in negative sentences. The only word that changes is the auxiliar word, do or does. The video will now stop and you will have an activity to form the present tense in negative sentences. Congratulations! Now you know how to form negative sentences in the present tense. I will see you back here again for the next lesson. Good luck!